It's Jen. I hope this video finds you well. So I have another paper haul from scrapbook.com. Okay, so these are more like collective hauls because I've been making purchases and now I need to get it all put up appropriately in their spots. So I um, wanted to share because these are some gorgeous papers. Um, <clears throat> so first off, this is um, a P13 uh, paper pad and I got this, this was a freebie um, a couple, couple weeks back, maybe a month ago. Um, and it's super pretty. I was like, oh, well, sure. And what's really cool is they do the cut aparts on the back. Look at that lovely library page. That is... Okay. So, like, that, I believe, is, like, the reference. The reference page. Um, from... Old school library. Mm -hmm. I remember that. So. But look at these images. Look at the little camera and the little cake. The little champagne glasses. So this could be, of course, used as a wedding. Um, but you could also use it for other things. I just thought it was really pretty. It's double-sided. colors are gorgeous and I've actually um, used some of this in a project so then you've got the little wreaths the different styles this one's got a key in it this one's purple I mean they're just they're gorgeous the butterflies you could totally cut those apart and it just, it repeats. No, postcard paper. And here's the cut aparts on the front page. And then of course you could always cut that out. But that is a always and forever and that's a P13. And the papers, pretty pretty sturdy feeling so it's a thicker paper oh and I forgot so it's a six by eight designer pack and I apologize I when I did my witches or the midnight tales for the graphic 45s I sat there and called that uh, eight by eight paper pack a six by six paper pack through the whole video so I'm a little rusty on my video making skills um but this one is a six by eight it's 24 double-sided sheets, four sheets of six designs with the two bonuses on the cover. So, then I wanted to share this item. Now, this I ordered, and this is just gorgeous. So, this is the uh, 49 in Market. And, oh my gosh, the paper. I'm oh, sorry for the crinkle the paper on this and it's not attached is so sturdy. Look at that. Oh, it's just gorgeous. Oh, okay. So it's the six by eight collection pack and it includes four each of eight double-sided pattern papers to each of two laser cut element sheets. So this is just, oh, it's just wonderful. I cannot wait to play with this one. So I got one, two, three, four. And that's what the back is. And I mean, that's four sheets and look at the thickness. Gorgeous paper. And I wanted to do the neutral, so. I thought these might be nice for like wedding or sympathy cards or just you know a beautiful birthday card and they're just so thick and good quality and that's your dictionary page very mixed media it's very soft mix it or what I call a soft mixed media to me Here's 
this one. It's got a little doily in there. Very dark. Back. It's just so pretty. Of course, you can add your own layers to it. This is like your vintage wallpaper type. Pattern. This one's a little darker. It's got the butterfly or moth there. And some leaves, images. And then it goes into, which I thought this was great because this is an excellent size. They've reproduced the image, but they've cut it, shrunk it to two on a spot with a little bit of differences. So you could probably just fold this in half and make it a card or just cut it right down there. And here were some like cut aparts for journaling spots. And this is done in force. I just thought that was so pretty. And then here are the laser die cuts. Aren't those gorgeous? I cannot wait. Um, I've got to send out something to a friend, so I'm going to make a beautiful card for them out of this. Little fence, isn't that just oh, it's so delicate. And again, it, it does come with a set of two of the laser die cuts. And here's this, and this is this is the back. So they decorate the back as well. Of course you could do all that. So that is the. Oh, I don't lost the front of it. Here I roll. It's on here somewhere. There it is. So it's the Vintage Artistry Essentials. And that is a 49 in market. I love this. Live with purpose. Yes. All about that. Okay. So then here was another little order um, from scrapbook.com. And they included this little flyer and it's got the uh, Echo Park paper, which I think that flower garden is gorgeous. I think every time I've tried to look at it or order it, it's been gone. So go figure. Not sure if I'll get to see that one or not, but we'll see. I'm not, I'm trying not to purchase anything else for a while because I've got some other stuff I've got to do. I apologize for the glare. Um, this order happened to have a freebie of the uh, alpha stickers. So. All right, so again, this is uh, the P13 paper. And this is the first time that, um, oh shoot. The, um, always and forever. That was the first time I had encountered or worked to see the P13 paper. And so I really liked it. So I kind of went sneaking around and poking around and roaming and saw these and thought these were very pretty and they were on sale. They were having a big old sale. So this is the Four Seasons Autumn, and look at that. Look at these colors, they are so gorgeous. I'm trying to move that out of the way so it's less distracting if possible. Um, okay. So, look. Look at the images in here. Oh, this is so gorgeous. Look at that deer. The mushrooms. Basket, and if you're a knitter, you like to knit or crochet this is gorgeous I'm just love all these fall colors 
Oh, I forget. It's a six by six designer pack, 24 double sided sheets, four sheets of six designs, two bonuses on the cover. Isn't that beautiful? Oh, this is just simply stunning. And look at the cute little hedgehog sitting there. He just makes my heart happy. Oh, he's so cute. And on this one, there's a little bitty tiny owl. Just hanging out. Looking all cute. Apples. And then look at all these little cut aparts. These are gonna make the cutest cards. Little bird. There's our little hedgehog. My little deer. Little squirrel. Little mushrooms. So pretty. And there's the knitting again. The little thermos. It's a wood. And then look at all these little babies sitting in the wreaths. It's very regal looking. Oh, it's so pretty. Oh, and it's got the little banners on some of them. So sweet. Look at that teal. I love the teal with the fall colors. It's just a beautiful vibe. And then it repeats. So we'll just flip this way because I got to show you the last page the cut aparts so there's our owl there's our cute little hedgehog the bird the squirrel so just super pretty images that they have available so and that is the Four Seasons Autumn. Now they had these on sale. So this is the decorative tags. Sorry for the crinkle. You know how it is with these shares. Oh look, how cute. Okay, so I, I hadn't taken these out of the package. Look at that. I think that's wonderful how you could they redo stuff like that. Oh, look how pretty. Get the stamp. Put other word sentiments on these. Beautiful fall colors. Little pumpkin gourd. There's a sunflower. Is that a wheat? Looks like wheat. So they're all double sided. So if you want to use them in your dangly little things, then the back will be just as decorative. Very, very pretty. And so that is the Four Seasons Autumn decorative tags, and it's nine pieces. I want to say it was somewhere around it. Between a dollar fifty and two dollars, and I just thought, oh well, I'm gonna make cards. I should try to have the things. All right, and so this is the Four Seasons Autumn decorative tags, and there's eleven pieces. So cute! Look at that owl. Oh, he's precious. So these are backed apparently by cream, you yeah. know. So pretty. And there's our little hedgehog. He is adorable. And we've got our glasses and our pumpkin. Regal. I'm gonna go for that's a buck with those antlers there. Maybe it's a reindeer. No, it's probably a 
the year back. Um, oh, and look at that little basket full of blankets and apples and pumpkins. There's that sweet little deer. There's the little thermos. So cute. Little mushrooms. So that's some wood with some leaves and sunflowers on it. And then here's a wreath. And they do all have a tiny little hole in the top, so to use them in the tag format. Super pretty. So again, that was the Four Seasons Autumn decorative tags. Okay. So then, I thought, well, okay. Let's have a little summer. So this is the P13 again, six by six, 24 double-sided sheets, four sheets of six designs, two bonuses on the cover. And this is just, oh, it's stunning, it's gorgeous. Look at that, those are the cut aparts, that little bike. I gotta make sure you all can see this. I know, when I get towards the end of July, I've got a bunch of stuff going on between now and then, so towards the end of July, I will see about getting a little bit better of a setup. Maybe cover my working table. Look at that jar with the flowers, oh, so pretty. Volkswagen. You've got your strawberries. That's just a yellow pattern. Look at that. So beautifully, brightly colored. And these wreaths, they're delicate. They're just so delicate with the little daisies in them. And those soft looking watercolor type flowers. Got your little, your little car, and again, pretty stout paper. And then look at that, is that not gorgeous? Oh, sorry. But look at these little tiny cut aparts. So cute. The bicycle with those sunflowers. And the green, and it repeats. So we'll go ahead and flip through because, well, number one, this is it's just simply gorgeous. So let's look at it a couple times. Oh, it's just so pretty. And it just, for me, this just sparks the creativity. Oh, I'm so excited to be working with this. So I'm gonna pull out my Christmas, but I'm also gonna leave out my summer because I am gonna do some summer cards, so. Oh, look at that. What is that? Oh, it's a tiny little mailbox. Get the heck out. You wanna see that? How cute. I want a little pie. Amazing the things that you, you can look at some of this stuff many times and find new things, so. All right, let's get back here to this cut apart. This is the last page. It's a beautiful butterfly. There's the little mailbox, another car. Just beautiful images. Okay, so again, that is the um, Summer by P13. Four Seasons. I don't know if I'll get the winter in the fall. It, it could happen, or the winter and the spring, it could happen, we'll see. And then I got this. This is so cute. So this is Hocus Pocus, and it's the 13th birthday edition. And I apologize. I do not know how to pronounce that. I'm so sorry. It is 24 pages plus two bonus on the cover. And you know, so the front and the back. And it's a Hello P, it's a P13. But check this out. 
look at those images, you guys. Isn't she gorgeous? Look at the mushrooms and the sweet little owl and the martini with the eyeball in it. Oh, that is grand in my book. The sweet little pumpkin and the fluffy cats and the feather. I mean, it's just so artistic. I love it. And this is tiny, I think. It's teeny tiny little spiders. Teeny, itty bitty little spiders. But oh, isn't this beautiful? Look at those cats with the glasses, top hat. He's got a bandana and a bow tie, witch's hat. Oh, so pretty. The little spider from the little mushroom and the moss, the white moss. Those feathers. Oh, I love the hats, different styles. I'm so glad they come with like four sheets of each thing because it makes it really difficult to think about what you're going to have to cut apart when you've only got one or two. This makes it a little bit easier. So sweet. We'll flip on to the back because, of course, they use the front and back. So, And on this one, they don't do the images like on the other, but this is just solid color. So it is still usable, which is wonderful. Very pretty. I know. I love me some Halloween. It's just, it is what it is. Okay. Everybody, thank you for stopping by. If you want to see the progress on the bazillion list of projects I have and see the development of them, subscribe, stick around. Regardless, I hope you have a good day. Remember, you have the chance to create your life your way every day. Thanks. Bye-bye.